Hey, hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. More World 9 Madness with 9-4. Here we go. Wish me luck. More dangers will be ahead. And... Hi. Oh, this one. This one. This one gave me so much trouble. Uh, it's not the first two coins. Oh no, it's not them. It's the third coin. You have to keep an ice flower at, until the very end. Oh shoot. And I took a hit, but that's okay. There's a lot of power-ups in this level, so don't worry about it. Like, uh... No, go away. <laughs> okay, so, be very careful. Do not take many hits, and there's another ice flower power-up for you here. And don't lose it. <laughs> Just taking hits all over the place for no reason whatsoever, even though it's kind of a reason. But that power block is power block is kind of useless. Um, because what you want to do is get up there, and that'll. Well, I guess it's, it, it kind of helps a little bit. Wait, 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 wait! I need to do this. There we go. See, the first coin's not that hard. But the second coin, you're gonna need to throw a bomb on at it. And the third one, as I said, you need an ice flower for. So I'm most likely going to have to go through this stage a bunch of times until I get that power up. Anyway, once there is three enemies on one of these kinds of platforms, they start to fall down. Or wait, maybe it's just two. Uh, okay, it's just two, and that's going to be a problem! Yeah, oh boy. <laughs> wait, I need to grab you. There's the other coin. Wait, wait, I, I can use a bomb on from this cannon, okay. What? Not- Okay, I'm back at the spot near coin one. So, I must survive. I must make my time. And... All their base will belong to me. Or just coins, hopefully. <laughs> so, let's go through the rest of the stage and hopefully not die. I need another ice flower. At least for the future. So yeah, these platforms definitely start falling down when two enemies, or two sprites I should say, are on top of them, and that's kind of scary. But don't- whoa. <laughs> don't worry, it'll be okay. And for this one, as I said before, I need a bob on to throw at that coin, like this, and... There we go. Like that. And I can just go right down here. You don't have to keep this platform up, form up, but the next one you do, um... Uh, I, I, oh, I'm just so scared. It, I, I'll, it's just so stupid how you have to get into this. Uh, I did not know that was there, I'm serious. <laughs> it's just so stupid on how you have to get into the secret eggs that just wash us. Okay, you see you got this platform here. You got a couple of bob -omb cannons, you know, throwing their cannons. And I just took a hit. You have to freeze that piranha plant and walk into that red pipe over there. Yeah. Get the idea? That's why it's stupid, because you need to power up all the way to the end here. See this red pipe? Watch where it leads you to. There it is! It mocks you! It mocks you with its shiny goldness. <sighs> I'll be back, and hopefully I'll have a better run. Well, that was a pretty good run, but you know what I mean. I, I need to power up. Okay, we're coming up to the part, and this time I grab the pal block that's down there to try and kill off some bob -omb's if I can, you know, while I'm on top of this platform. But I gotta find a way to get on top of there without taking... Pff, what sucked? Without taking a hit from something, you know? So... Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Go up, go up, go up, go up, man, go! 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 I think I got this, I think I got this. Here we go, here we go! That's okay, it's okay. Yes, I made it! That wasn't as bad as I thought, or I should say as bad as I remember. And that's basically the stage. Oh, don't die. Please don't die. Thank you. <laughs> that would have sucked if I would have fell into one of those bottomless pits. Oh, well, that takes care of that stage. Let's go to the next one. Yes, there are toads to be rescued in this World 9 as well, but there aren't any toad houses, strangely. Well, maybe there is at that 
start arrow point thingy there once you rescue the toad. But as I've said before, I don't really care about rescuing the toads in the least. And needless to say, this is an ice theme level. This is a really hard level, actually. Uh, you've got these penguins. That platform will not uh, disappear if you, you know, are, aren't fast enough, so don't worry about it. You just have to avoid the penguins. And a penguin suit is a real benefit here. Uh, power up in general is a real benefit here because you've got penguins dropping on your head from all over the place. And you're also going to have some fuzzies, and you're going to have to freeze a fuzzy actually to get to the. Um, I hear a toad. Uh, I'm going to leave you behind. <laughs> You, you play with the penguins there, Toad. So I'm going to grab that, and you can grab these ice blocks to kill the penguins. Like, I'm going to use uh, an ice block to sweep the penguins like that so I can get through here. Yeah! For star coin number one. And you'll notice that they have a lot of air time. Three squares worth. So they'll most, mostly soar over your head if you stay near a corner. Um, over here, ooh. I thought, is that? Oh, that's four squares worth. Well, that explains it. <laughs> okay, what you want to do here, this is a lot easier if you do it like this. It's just like wall kick instead of trying to jump across those little blocks. There we go, like that for coin number two. And then you're going to want to hit the switch over there just to get a platform going up there, which is going to start offsetting the penguins. Um, I heard they were called Cooligans by CJV84US. I believe that's what he said. I'm, I'm probably gonna screw up on the name again. He's gonna be, gonna be like PK Gam. No. <laughs> anyway, let's uh, keep going up. And I really want to see what's above me here. Cause I don't want. To, ooh, I don't want to jump in a fuzzy. And I jumped in a fuzzy. Dang it. I'm pretty sure there's a power up coming up though. Anyway. Oh, and it's useless to me now. I tried to escape the fuzzy wrath, but I failed. Um, wait, wait. I could probably... No, I'm not gonna get the red coins in time, am I? Yeah. Oh, well, I guess I'm gonna have to come back here for a second run anyway, then. So I'm just gonna focus on getting to the end of the stage. Uh, it's not... The stage, after a certain point, isn't too hard. You just have to ride some moving blocks. Oh, there's another... power up! Gimme! <laughs> Um, see, this is where you need to freeze a fuzzy, that one down there, at the bottom right corner there. You need to freeze him so you can jump up and get that hiccup, excuse me, that coin. And uh, that's pretty hard to do even even when you do have a power-up. So it would, it would probably be best if I save my coins like I'm doing now and just come through the stage on a second run. Uh, okay, so careful, careful. There we go. And now we've got some fuzzies and one block jumps. One block ice jumps, yes. This is something that you see in hard Mario hacks, and they are just as hard as you expect them to be, because you're very, very slippery. So that might cause you a bit of trouble, as it will me, for sure. These blocks right here aren't slippery, because, you know, they're not ice. But those other ones sure are, and those fuzzies just put the pressure on you. Oh, wait a second, I might be able to get rid of... Ah, oh, it's over right over its head, that's okay. Well, I made it anyway. So this pipe over here takes you to the end. And then I'll be back for the last coin with, hopefully, a successful penguin suit run. And uh, there we go. What was the point of those blocks? I don't know, maybe to hit those other blocks, but you can hit them from underneath. Well, see you by the third coin. Okay, we're back over here. This is what you want to do. You want to freeze fuzzies like that, so you got to... Uh, a stable platform, and then ride it over to the coin if you can. This is gonna be tricky, very tricky. This gave me a lot of trouble, and this is what makes the stage so hard. This very last coin here, I, I really need to freeze that bottom fuzzy. That is priority one. The one that's on that other one off to the right, that bottom right corner one. Yeah, that one. No, 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 no. Need to freeze you. Get ah oh, so close! No, 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 no! I'm not gonna take a hit. I refuse to take a hit at this point. I've had a pretty good run so far. No deaths. I don't want to restart this level either. Let's just do this. 
work with me, Mario. No, I said work with me. Okay, work with me, Penguin Mario. Is that gonna be? Is that gonna be better? You know, being more formal. Maybe I don't know. I froze that one. I froze it. I got it. I got it. Oh wait, wait, wait. Yes. Okay. I'm pretty sure I got the stage now because I can freeze those fuzzies like that and use them as platforms rather than using these blocks or just take the hit. <laughs> I don't care. I made it through the stage. And I think I'm gonna do one more stage in this part before I end it off. Uh, maybe these blocks here at the end here are just like to stop you from sliding off the edge or something and you're not supposed to shake the Wii Remote accidentally to pick them up to, and then you would fly off the edge or something. I don't know. What's the point of those blocks? Seriously. Maybe they're just for detailing. Anyway, 9-6. I don't care about you told you. You can go play with whatever enemies are over there too. <laughs> So, here we go! Things are getting exciting. We've got the Lava World. Remember I was saying the music in the World 8 or any Lava World was really good? Listen! Yeah, I think it's pretty awesome. <laughs> anyway, down here, you're gonna see a star coin. Very, very obvious star coin there. And uh, needless to say, touch the lava, you die. But these platforms aren't as dangerous as they look. They only stay into the lava for a very brief seconds. So even when you're standing on top of one, you can survive simply by constantly jumping on top of them. See, like that. Even this one here, this very large one, yeah, no problem whatsoever. Um, the next star coin, or maybe it's the last star coin in this level, is very tricky. Uh, I forgot. Fire Chomp, you're going down before you become trouble and start spewing your fireballs all over the place. I hate your hot vomit. You shouldn't have had some Mexican food. <laughs> uh, anyway, so there we go. And careful, there we go. Wait, can I like wall kick up there? I probably can. There we go. That was a pretty easy one. I'm pretty sure the last one, yep, right there. And... Whoop. Okay, last star coin coming up here. This is what makes... By the way, the, uh, they aren't immune to fire. <laughs> I forgot to mention that before. Strangely, even though they spew fire, they're not immune to fire. Anyway, the last star coin. Very tricky to get if you don't have a propeller mushroom. It is over here. You know, see that fire spout there? Uh, I gotta get rid of that flame trunk first. He's gonna be a lot of trouble. <laughs> See that? Yeah, the coin is down there. You gotta time your jump on the platform with the fire spell to get underneath that ledge to get the coin. <laughs> yeah, you get the idea. It's pretty tricky, and here comes another freaking fire chomp! Well, at least these fire spells don't come very often. So I should be able to... Oh, no, 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 no! Freaking Jesus! <laughs> Oh, come on! Okay, those deaths that you've seen were just pure carelessness on my part here. So, let's just be a little more careful. This stage isn't hard to get through in the least. You just have to be good with timing on platforms. Okay. Now, I must be very careful. I must time my jump just right to get onto that... No, not you again. To get on that platform. There we go. I don't care if I take the hit, just go! Yes! That's the end of this stage! And also the end of this part, I think. Unless I die here, which I don't think I'm gonna do. Unless I'm gonna be really careless again. Nope! There we go! So, hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part, when I tackle the final two stages of World 9.